Hello, this is Dennis McDonald with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can get us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com. This is a customer's telephone, Alex, from Connecticut. And this is a Western Electric wall telephone from the 50s. And we had a bell issue um, that we were showing you in the last video where we um, did some work on the bell and we ran out of time because they don't give you too much time on YouTube. And I want to show you real quick, um, we're going to do a bell conversion just so that we know that this bell is going to work. And so what I'm going to do here is um, I want to do a couple of things. I want to remove... I want to remove this wire and I want to remove this one sometimes they come out a little bit easy and then other times you kinda of gotta fight with them a little bit but we'll get that uh, we'll get that squared away now I want to take this wire off real quick. And what we're going to do here, this solder is really, really old. So basically what we're going to do here is we're going to, we're going to save this wire. We're going to put it back on. I want to clean my uh, soldering iron a little bit, and I want to get some. I want to get some new solder on that connection there. Kind of revitalize the solder. And this one we're not going to do anything with because we're not connecting that up. Okay, now. What we're going to do here is I'm going to solder this capacitor at this connection here. So I want to put this, you can see what I'm doing, I'm putting this leg of this capacitor into this solder and I'm going to use this bracket here as um, a little bracket to kind of hold my uh, to kind of hold my capacitor in in place, I'm going to take my and bend that cap over just a hair, and um, we want to we want to solder this capacitor into place here. And you always want to kind of check your work. You want to make sure that that took. Now this is where we're going to come back with this wire that we took off. One of the wires that we took off that belongs to this connection here. We're going to tin that wire up good. And we also want to get some solder on the cap. We want to solder that to the capacitor. We want to make sure that that took good. And then um, what we're going to do is we're going to have a connection here now that's going to go to the network on uh, on your incoming line and then uh, we're going to have our other connection that'll go to the network on the incoming line and um, a lot of times we end up having to repair 
our tools as we go along. So my little clip fell off of our um, of our alligator uh, line clip. So we're gonna solder that on real quick and get that on. Okay, and we'll show you. what we have to do to get this bell to ring. Make sure that sticks. That should be good. And then what we're going to do is we're going to ring this bell now. So now we have uh, two clips that go to the network. We can ring it. Okay, now all we have to do to this bell is we're going to put it back in. We want to make sure there's a hole here. There's a hole here for this adjustment right here. And what we want to do is we want to make sure that we get that hole of the bell into that adjustment. And this will take a little bit to get this uh, into place. And that's pushed into place now. We want to make sure we get all of our wires where we want them. So it just takes a little bit of uh, positioning everything. And now what we can do is we can tighten down the bell because everything is in place. And I'm just going to put one screw in it because what we're going to do here real quick is I'm going to show you how this works. We're going to connect this up to the up to the network and I just want to do this quickly because they don't give us much time should have dial tone I'm going to hang the phone up and then I'm going to ring it. So now we know there is no question um, that the bell will ring. We have added our capacitor and there is usually a capacitor in the network and that's what causes the bell to ring but we we've added a capacitor so there's no question um, that the bell is going to ring the bell is to definitely going to ring now and we're going to secure the capacitor with a piece of double-sided sticky tape and get that back to normal uh, we may do a final video of this telephone because we still have to install uh, put the phone back together again and get some of our wires put back the way we want them and then we have to put in a uh, dial center and ring
right there at the dial center. And we still want to clean our um, rotary. So we want to take our rotary out and clean that. So we were out of time. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. A1 Telephone Service and Repair. Thank you.